Hey folks, Lisa here with another quick Outlook tip of the day. Today's tip is actually going to mirror another YouTube video I have out there that has almost 7,000 views. It's very popular. It's called How to View a Shared Exchange and Outlook Calendar on iPhone. A lot of my clients call in and they want to share contacts on the iPhone off their exchange. Well, I'm just going to let you know that you can try as much as you want to, but you might not ever get that to work. So you can try public contacts that won't be shared on the iPhone either and third-party apps are really challenging so the easiest thing to do is to create a new mailbox called info or shared or something like that spend the money I recommend it's only five dollars a month so spend the money and get a new mailbox and then you can dedicate that mailbox to maybe the info account you know that other people can manage that account then you can have a company calendar well, you know, like vacation time off, birthdays, anniversaries, you know, hot dog day, whatever, chili cook off, stuff like that. Um, and then you can create a contacts, uh, contacts list out of that. And then in there you can create sub contact lists for like special things like vendors and departments and, you know, other things you want. So within that context, you can have sub ones. And then you move all the contacts over into the right areas and you've actually got many groups and lists and then people can add that to their phones and then they have to swipe off like the mail and calendar if they don't want to view the contacts because remember it's open to the whole company whoever has that access so I tell people make sure that you uh, trust the people that have that access because they have full owner rights but you almost have to if you want it to work and I also recommend you get a backup program for your exchange. Um, I think one's called spanning.com. They have a pretty good online backup. So in case you have a rogue employee that decides to go and destroy data and then leave, you got a backup. So they can destroy it all they want and your data is safe. That's my tip for the day, folks. If you have any questions, feel free to call me, 612-865-4475. You can email me, lisa at callthatgirl.biz. And if you like this video, please remember to down below, go like, share, and subscribe. Thanks.